Hi, welcome to the video. Um, it's been raining quite hard outside, so I'm just in the shed actually at the minute, just doing some sharpening and things. But uh, what I thought I'd do is just make a little uh, an update video on the Bluetooth headphones, the still Bluetooth headphones that I've had for about 18 months now. And I've got to say, they're pretty much as good as new. The sound quality is just as good. Obviously, uh, you can use them as Bluetooth headphones. Um, and also you can use them as hands-free so with the phone you've got the little microphone in there which um, I didn't actually know about in the first review video if you remember um, but as I say the sound quality is great they're still in one piece I've caught the uh, the wires a couple of times ducking under bushes and and trees and things but you know it's pretty sturdy it's all still in one piece which is great and the battery life is just as good as it was which is uh, obviously pretty important um, but there was one thing I noticed that the the, the rubber bit which uh, makes contact with around your ear had started to go brittle and kind of quite harden off which is really common with all ear defenders in my experience and normally what you do is if they were cheap ear defenders you just throw them away buy a new pair or if you work with a group of lads then maybe what you might do is just find a nicer pair and write your name on them really quickly <laughs> I'm not saying I used to do that. Um, but one thing I wanted you to be aware of is, as I say, with cheaper pairs you just throw them away, but with an expensive set like this, it's not really what you want to do. So what you can do is buy parts, still now sell parts, and this rubber bit or plastic bit, spongy bit that I was talking about, you can now buy that um, as, a, as a spare part. It's known as a hygiene pack, and what I've been able to do is to take the foam out on the inside, the foam, little shieldy bit here, and this rubber clip, which just clips out, and then you just clip it back in. Uh, it took me about two minutes probably to change it over. Uh, now, this is the bit which is in contact with your head, and it causes that perfect seal, and they're basically like brand new now. Because what I found with, as they were going a bit brittle, as you do with with all ear defenders that the seal just wasn't quite as good particularly if I was wearing say a baseball cap or when I had safety glasses on that it just didn't quite have the, the pliability is that the right word to kind of go round and, and make that perfect seal to keep the noise out so particularly when I was listening to podcasts uh, when I was on a, a big tractor mower it just was becoming a little bit harder to do that but now I've create, put the, the hygiene pack on and it's now got that perfect seal again. It's, as I say, brand new. So, um, yeah, just thought I'd share, you, share that with you that, you know, for the money, 18 months down the road, I'm really, really pleased with it. So not only can you buy replacement parts for the ear defenders, you can also buy attachments. So if you're strimming an area and you want to put the visor down, you can do. So you have the, the grill visor, also have the Perspect plastic, which goes down. So if you're streaming in an area and you think there might be some dog dirt about, then that's always quite a good one um, so that you don't have to eat that um, or, or get that in your face. And all you would do is just buy that attachment and then they just clip onto it. So you still, you're able to protect your face, but also take any incoming calls or listen to your music at the same time. 